Hello, Illumina community. I'm Tim Gilmartin, a field application scientist at Illumina. Congratulations on your purchase of the iSeq 100, Illumina's first user-installable sequencing system. Did you know there's a wealth of support materials on Illumina's website to help you get up and running? In this video, we will highlight the valuable user guides, videos, and online courses at your disposal that will help you install and use your iSeq 100 system. This includes resources that will help you prepare your site for your iSeq 100 installation, use your instrument to perform sequencing runs, and assess performance, troubleshoot, and optimize your runs. And for those of you who are new to next generation sequencing, we will also highlight key resources that can assist with the processes upstream and downstream of your sequencing runs. Let's get started. So you've placed your order and are now awaiting the iSeq 100 system to arrive. The iSeq 100 Site Prep Guide, available on the iSeq 100 Sequencing System Support page, provides specifications and guidelines for preparing your site for installation and operation of the iSeq 100 Sequencing System. This guide includes recommendations for first-time setup, physical lab space, and environmental and electrical requirements for best utilization of the iSeq 100. For example, if you need to confirm the required ambient lab temperature range or peak power consumption of the iSeq 100 system during a run, the Site Prep Guide contains this information. Additionally, the Site Prep Guide also contains guidance for networking your system, including data transfer considerations, network and computer security, network connections, control computer connections, and operating system configurations. Prior to delivery, you can use the Unboxing and Installing Your Instrument training to prepare your lab, see how to unpack, install, and verify first-time setup. To simplify the customer onboarding process, Illumina has compiled a list of Next Generation Sequencing, or NGS, support materials for all customers, both new and experienced. This compilation is the iSeq 100 Customer Onboarding Resource List, or the iScore list. This resource list directs you to numerous resources and documents needed during an NGS workflow, such as experimental design, library prep and quality control, FIAX control preparation and spike in, instrument maintenance, and data analysis. The iScore list also highlights many iSeq 100 sequencing system support pages on the Illumina website. These pages provide additional library prep, system and analysis resources. For example, the support bulletin Technical Resources for iSeq 100, seen here, lists several commonly used technical documents for using the iSeq 100 system, many of which are available in over 30 languages, like the iSeq 100 Sequencing System Guide. To familiarize yourself with your new system, use the iSeq 100 Sequencing System Guide. This resource provides a system overview and instructions for operating and maintaining the iSeq 100 sequencing system. If you already have installed the iSeq 100 sequencing system, you can use the How to Start a Run training to see the steps in preparing the consumables, starting an iSeq 100 sequencing run, and using the iSeq control software. If you want more detail about Local Run Manager, the instrument software that allows you to set up sequencing run parameters and view analysis results, you will want to use the Local Run Manager training. We keep all these materials up to date, so always check support pages for the latest versions. After you've completed a sequencing run, and you want guidance and key metrics for assessing the run performance, review the Does My Run Look Good training. This training will help you determine if the run was successful, and show you how you can optimize the process to get even more data. Another online course available on the iSeq 100 System Support webpage is the Maintenance and Troubleshooting Training. This training highlights steps for maintaining and troubleshooting the iSeq 100. In addition to the previously mentioned resources on the iSeq 100 Support page, we have created a separate expert video tip that will highlight some routine troubleshooting and optimization you can perform yourself, and where you can turn to for troubleshooting assistance. Illumina Proactive is a monitoring service in which instrument performance data are sent to Illumina to facilitate proactive maintenance. If you enable Illumina Proactive on your iSeq 100, your Illumina service and support team has direct access to your instrument performance parameters and can help you diagnose and troubleshoot instrument issues quickly. 
For more information on Illumina Proactive, including data security considerations, you can view the expert video tip or see the Illumina Proactive technical note. The iSeq100 system makes next generation sequencing easier and more affordable than ever. It is an ideal starting point for many scientists who are new to next generation sequencing. To ensure success, however, a user will still need to pay attention to library prep, library QC, and data analysis efforts. In addition to the iScore list we mentioned earlier in the video, there are abundant resources that can assist with the processes upstream and downstream of your sequencing runs. Expert video tips, like the one you are currently watching, are available for numerous commonly discussed topics, ranging from preventing contamination in your lab to best practices for library preparation. These videos can be especially valuable to scientists new to NGS and can enable faster adoption in your lab. You can find these on Illumina's support site in the training videos page when filtered for video tips. Two such video tutorials are parts one and two of how do I achieve consistent quantitation. Variations and inconsistencies can arise in quantitation for NGS libraries, and these videos discuss the differences in several quantitation methods and offer tips and tricks for getting more consistent quantitation. Many iSeq100 users will be working with targeted Amplicon panels. Another two-part FAQ is how do I optimize Amplicon sequencing data? which discusses best practices for sequencing amplicons on Illumina instruments with high quality results. There's a lot to learn, but you're not alone in NGS. There's an entire community of scientists and researchers paving the way. The community at Illumina is an open space where researchers can come together to support one another, collaborate on great science, and inspire innovations that transform the world. Specifically, there is an iSeq100 forum, a library preparation forum, and a new to NGS forum. One tool to highlight found in the new to NGS forum is the new user resource guide, an end-to-end -end overview guide of the Illumina NGS workflow. It also provides online resources to describe and explain the Illumina technology, library preparation, sequencing platforms, and data analysis options. It is an excellent starting point for members of the Illumina community new to NGS. In this video, we've highlighted existing resources, trainings, and online communities to help accelerate your adoption and utilization of your iSeq100 system. In addition to these iSeq100 system-specific trainings and videos, the iSeq100 Illumina support page also contains introductory courses detailing Illumina's sequencing technology, as well as library preparation courses, such as AmpliSeq for Illumina and Nextera DNA Flex. If this is your first experience with NGS and Illumina, welcome. Whether you're a new or experienced user, remember you can always contact Illumina Technical Support for assistance with your NGS efforts. Thanks for purchasing the iSeq100 system, and as always, thanks for being part of the Illumina community.